With race first of two eliminations for the quarter of a million dollar Berries Creek for three year old Pacers next Saturday top five make the final. Brandon's Cowboy has quickly become a major player in the three year old ranks after his devastating Suslo series sweep. New Jersey champ Squaws fellow will be fitter. Georgia Pacific always tough. They're off. Car holder and driven to win now out fast. Squaws fellow. Those three leaving. Village Hero in with some early speed there. Mentacular on the rail. Steps out. A bit of early speed from him around the first turn. It's driven to win. And here comes Miller with Squaws fellow. A quick burst from Squaws fellow to the top here. Driven to win second. Campbell's out with a whip on Mentacular going for the lead. As they head to the opening quarter gap at two. Brandon's Cowboy. The favorite is fourth past the quarter. Village Hero in is fifth. Card holders parked out sixth. Then it's O'Neir Utak Pat on the inside. Georgia Pacific near the back of the pack, followed by Wind Age, Hanover, and PT's Gold Dust. And here comes Brandon's Cowboy charging after Mantacular off a quarter of 27 and 3. It's Brandon's Cowboy now, breezing up, and he brushes to the top here with Dubay. Mantacular back in the second spot. Squaws Fella under a tight rein third. Gap at two lengths. Card holder first over up into fourth on the outside. Driven to win is fifth. Following live cover is Georgia Pacific is uh, sixth on the outside past the half. Then it's Village Hero and followed by PT's Gold Dust with O'Neir Utak Pat and uh, Windage Hanover. The half was 54 and 2. Pretty good clip here in this one. Brandon's Cowboy at 3 to 5 leads at a length and a half. Mantacular is second and grinding first over into it. Card Holder, he's now second and challenging, towing Georgia Pacific into it. Perfect trip for Sears so far in fourth. Squaws fellas shuffle to fifth on the inside. Looking poised third over is PT's Gold Dust. Big move back of the pack. O'Neir Utak Pat fanning out, but some ground to make up 123. They're into the stretch drive now, and Brendan Scalboy looks to accelerate away, but charging late is Georgia Pacific after the perfect cover trip. Sears rousing him. Georgia Pacific on the outside. It's still Brendan Scalboy. They're trying to last in, last to the Cowboy, but they can't do it. It's Brendan Scalboy. Four in a row for Brendan Scalboy. Georgia Pacific was next. Followed by the next Gallo blue chip, well, he's still about $4 million away in career earnings, but the team of Dubay and Mark Ford had to feel very good about this career best effort which was done on his own terms. Afterwards, Dubay said he loves the Colts' versatility and feels strongly he'll be able to handle the best three-year-olds in training down the road. Unfortunate break by Mantacular, who got ranked in the two-hole at the top of the stretch. I can't wait for Georgia Pacific to have some racing life.